revenue loss through fuel adulteration is expected to reduce after the rolling out of the petroleum product marking scheme. Now, the first phase of the project saved the country in excess of 249 million cities between September 2013 and December 2019. The Petroleum Product Marking Scheme, PPMS, which began in 2013, seeks to ensure quality petroleum products for consumers, promote fair business competition, increase tax base and revenue for the country. It involves the insertion of a fuel marker into petroleum products at the loading depot prior delivery to retail outlets. An effective fuel quality management system in place will ensure that the quality of petroleum products are constantly monitored by poor quality tests and analysis to mitigate all potential effects of poor quality fuels and assure the customer of improved quality of fuel and value for money. All local petroleum products, including diesel, gasoline, kerosene, and premix, will be marked. Deputy Energy Minister Dr. Mohamed Amin Adams is optimistic it will ensure value for money in the downstream supply chain. Fuel market is not free, we know that. And it has impact on petroleum product prices. We will not have been paying for it, but for the bad ones amongst us. So all of our citizens of Ghana must be vigilant and continue to expose those bad ones. Chief of Staff Freema Opare assured players in the petroleum downstream of government support to promote sanity in the sector. As a result of sustained successful marking and field monitoring of marked petroleum products, the results obtained from September 2013 to December 2019 indicated a drop in the rate of violations from 32% to 1.99%. A central laboratory which will promote fairness whenever disputes arise in ascertaining the quality or otherwise of petroleum products in the marking has also been established. The establishment of the central lab is in conformity with the legislative instrument LI 2187, which relates to the implementation of petroleum product marking scheme, PPMS.